Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Shen Plays. I am your host, Shenra. We are back in the land of Flanders. Last episode, we started the Reconquista. Good times were had by all. We were able to give one, two, three, four, five provinces to other people, so we didn't actually take any aggressive expansion for that. And uh, it was a defensive war, so I'm glad that we were able to defend our buddy Asturias uh, and also give some land to them, and uh, Toulouse, and Valoy, and Galicia. Everyone got some land. Good times. And now we're trying to defend Brittany for the second time. This is the second time we're defending Brittany from France. These French, man, they just, they just can't... They can't stop being aggressive. They gotta keep going to war, and it's just... I don't know. I'm jelly and all, because I got this regency for nine more years. Oh my god. Nine more years of regency. Oh, shit. So, yeah. We need to do something about Mr. Francy Pants. I think the best thing we can do is simply siege him up, make him release some of the people that he used to used to have as vassals, and uh, maybe what we'll do is maybe we'll just take Switzerland as our vassal. Hmm. Maybe. Anywho, onward. Continue. Oh. Hello, France. Fancy meeting you here. Squish. So yeah, we're going to beat up France again because they need it. They need it. They need it. Oh shit, we're under attack in Poitou. Damn it. Why would you attack me? That's just mean. Ah, oh, well, they died. Good times were had by all. Could tech up our admin. Mm, maybe. It's nice to see that we're ahead on military tech, though. Feels good, man. It feels good being ahead on tech. Ooh, Normandy declared war on Brittany. God damn it. Oh, I can, I can enforce peace on Normandy as well. Ooh, that is a possibility. Did anyone join his war? Nope. Nobody joined Normandy's war. Okay. Hmm. Then I think, yeah, I think we should do this. Let's get to the border, shall we? And there's no real rush. Is that his whole army? 13 guys? Probably is. Yep, 13 guys, but he does have 21,000 manpower. That's pretty good, but I guess it's because he has Paris, Champagne, and a lot of other stuff. Ooh, admin points or prestige? I'll take the admin points. Thank you very much. And in the meantime, our vassals are just sieging away. Good times. So France is trying to group up a stack over here, which is fine. I like to see him putting effort into this war. Um, of course, it's all going to be for naught. Meath annexed Desmond. So Meath is the dominant power. They will form Ireland as soon as he gets Canucked. Uh, he's going to have to fight Scotland for that, though, which is fine. Good luck. Fight Scotland. Enjoy. We have too many universities. You can only have one university. No matter how many you actually control, they all get destroyed until you have one left. We've been attacked. It's a trap. It's okay, though. We got this shit. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. And because this little nation that I completely forgot about, Finn, because they're a separate entity and their main their main culture is Norse, they're having Norse patriots flip land to them. So Denmark is screwed, but oh well. Oh well.
Cardinal is disloyal. That's fine. He's so old. I'm just going to ignore him. We might go for this guy, though. Or we, we can just wait for someone younger to come around. You know me. I, I, I like him young. Germany declared war on Saxony. There we go. Big war. Big war. Second time Germany has declared war on Saxony. German conquest of Cassel. And Saxony is at war with Germany. Slavonia, Tyrol, Brandenburg versus Saxony and Carinthia. I think Germany has that one. No guarantees, but... I think so. I think they've got it. Noble family requests aid. Either we lose admin points or we lose 266 ducats. Well, since we have 266 ducats, I'll just pay it. It's always nice when you can afford things like that. Oh, hello, Switzerland. Goodbye, Switzerland. Ah, ah good times. Forty is the new twenty. Yeah, pretty much. Oh shit. He's got pretender rebels all up in my face. That's okay, we got it. Alright, let us fabricate a claim on Paris. Actually, do I want to do that? You know, I might as well. There's no reason not to have a claim on Paris, right? Mm, what missions are out there anyway? Make Brandenburg vote for us. We can't because this should not even be a thing because our, 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 our next leader is going to be a woman. So there's no way anyone's going to vote for us. Become baby controller? That's possible. Grand Fleet? We're not going to do that. We got pop-ups for Oxford and Brabant. Yeah, we do have university at Oxford. And we do have university at Brabant. Um, we're not supposed to have two. I I think that's just something wrong with the converter. The CK2 converter. Because we're not supposed to have two. If anyone knows if that's a converter thing or what, let me know. But you're not supposed to have two. No, oh, France is no longer embargoing me? Why not? Why not, France? Why you no embargo me, France? Rolling zeros, not good. Let's get out of there. Yep, more land is flipping to Finn. Whatever, Denmark is screwed. That's my bad. I didn't notice Finn, or else I would have deleted them and given the land to Denmark. Oh well. Yeah, kill those Frenchies. Squish, please. Squish, good times. I think now's the time we want to invade Switzerland. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so we'll siege up Switzerland. We'll siege up France. And then the question is, do we take Switzerland as a vassal? 
or do we make France release other nations? Because we could make him release a four province Provence or a four province what was that nation called? Marsan. Either or. They're both good. Plans on colonization? Yes, indeed. We do plan on colonization. It's one of our four goals for this campaign. So what do, you, what do you guys think? What would be a better choice for us? As as Flanders, not just trying to be a power monger, whatever. But what would be our best choice as Flanders? Should we take Switzerland as a vassal? Or should we make France release one of his other uh, used-to-be vassals? Do both? I don't think we can do both. What are the Tengri bonus? Let's find out. Tengri bonus are cheaper stability and better chance of a new heir. Not very good bonuses. Unseed Brittany? Yeah, we do need to do that. Saxony's in another war. Does that mean Germany's winning? Uh, a little bit. Welligrad, Munster, and Bremen. What's that for? Welligrad, Reconquest of Lauenburg. Okay. Well, see, Switzerland is not on our trade node. So this is why I was asking. We could try to stick to just our trade node and just ignore Switzerland entirely, just maybe make them release their vassalage of them. Uh, if we wanted to take lands in the trade node, that would be Vermandois, Champagne, Nemours, Bourgogne, Franche Comte, Charolais, and Lyonnais. So we could do that. Alright, you guys get out of there. And Burn has sieged. Okay, good. Uh, let's swap you in over there. Take these guys out. Come on, end of the month. There we go. Good times. All right, now we have two diplomats. Uh, yeah, get relations up with Mercia. I mean, we're at the point now, 90%. We can do whatever we want. So what do you guys think we should do here? Reform Norse bonuses. Don't worry about that right now. You like that plan? What plan? Convert Italy OP. Yeah, Italy's pretty good. Uh, we have as vassals... Let me check real quick. We have Luxembourg, Swabia, and Mercia. What happened to England? They never existed. They're not a thing. The closest they got was uh, the Petty Kingdom of Wessex. They did not advance beyond the Petty Kingdom of Wessex.
Uh oh, call for peace. Yeah, we're at 97%, so we can do whatever we want. Alright, so what do you guys think we should do? Let's see. Build up the trade node. You like the Italian color? Go ahead and make France split into bits. Well, let's see what's available in the peace deal. If we make him get rid of his vassal Switzerland, that's 38%. If we take Switzerland, that's 76%. So it's very expensive to take Switzerland. I think I just not take Switzerland. Okay, so make him release Switzerland. And then can we get anything out of him? Uh, releasing Marsan would be 89 war score. We can't do it. That puts us way over 100. Wow, look how expensive that is. Wow. That sucks. So maybe instead, maybe instead of releasing those guys, how about we uh, take some of the land on our trade node? So any of these four provinces would be good. Yeah, because we, we can't release Marsan, unfortunately. So yeah, we'll siege up this stuff. And we'll look at taking some land. Release Bourbon. It would be one province. I really don't want to release a one province miner. Seems a little... I don't know, silly? Who the hell releases a one province miner? And Finn has declared war on Denmark. This nation that I didn't notice because their color is so similar to Denmark, I just never noticed they existed and they start on a frickin' island. Now they are so big that they're declaring war on Denmark. God damn it. God damn it, game! Alright, come on, finish them sieges. Finish them sieges. I'm on my first beer of the day. So if I start doing stupid stuff, um, I'm just going to blame that. Ooh, Amalfi is the papal controller. Really? Amalfi, congratulations! Yeah, he's got uh, two guys in the Curia, albeit one of them is super duper old. Still, good job. Oh my god, and the Pope got the freebie with 100 free points. I really don't like the Pope getting the freebie with 100, 100 free points. The whole Curia system is stupid if you ask me. But you didn't ask me, did ya? Did ya? I think I will invest in that guy. Fuck it. Fuck the Pope. Fuck the Pope right in the ass. Come on, sieges. Finish them sieges. Alright, there goes Dauphine. Move on. We're so close. Screw it, get out of there. There we go. No, France is coming for me. Go away. <laughs> no, he caught me. Fuck off, France, you son of a bitch. I couldn't finish my siege as quickly enough. There we go, now I can retreat. Get out of there. Screw you, France. I totally am at 98%, 97%. Uh, gain prestige, lose papal influence... No, I'll lose the prestige because we're going to get tons of prestige anyway. Oh my god, Austria finally took Ostmarch. It took him like 20 years to finish that war. My goodness. But he finished it, goddammit. He got Ostmark back. Good job, Austria. I don't know why he's a tech behind in military, but whatever. Pomerania, we'll see. Oh, there we go. Poland now has Danzig. Now we're talking. So let's see if he can do this whole personal union over Lithuania thing. He has Donzig, he has Jagiellon, just like Lithuania. So maybe he can enter union? Poland can enter union? Maybe. Come on, finish the damn sieges. Hurry up. There's Franche Comte. Good, good. Oh my god, if, if these rebels finish before we finish... Burgon. I'm gonna just I'm just gonna die. France took Rethel. Oh, 
What the hell? How did they get that? Weird. I don't really... Not gonna worry about that too much. Uh, we can't fabricate a claim on it or anything, so... Eh. But yeah, they certainly did take Rathel. Look at that. Come on, finish the siege. 35%. Stop failing. I'm going to send my general in there. Finish the siege, please. Forty-nine percent. Don't you fail me now. Don't you dare fail me now, you son of a bitch. Come on. Damn it! You fucking failed again! Motherfucker. What is with all this failing? Please? 49%. Please, please, please? Yes! Oh, there we go. Finally. Alright, get out of here. Get over there. And let's peace out. Well, let's get our troops out of his... No, it'll be my land. Doesn't matter. Alright, so we're going to release Switzerland. Let me make sure I get this done. Release Switzerland, and we're going to take whatever we can. 85. 98! There we go. 98. War score. Uh, or... Or we could go for Lyonne. No, that's too much war score. Oh, shit. Oh, we could do that. The reason I'm thinking that might be good is because there we can release Provence as a vassal and then feed them. Mm, it would look really weird, though. It would look really weird. Uh, no. It just looks too weird. I can't do it. Can't do it. Anywho, let's go ahead and uh, peace out. And I know this is... Ah. Oh, I oh. oh, goodness. If we release Provence, we'll be at 7 out of 4 relationships. It's too many relations. Hmm. Mm, damn it. I don't want so many relations. We're never going to get tech. It will look weird regardless. Yeah, it will. No matter what we do, I mean, that would look good in my book. That looks weird. And that looks even weirder. Is Finn Norse religion? Yes, of course they are. Yeah, I'm not going to release Provence. Oh, you're right. We can't release Provence because it's the wrong culture. Good call. Good call. It's the wrong culture. This province is not uh, Akatane. So, good call. All right, peace. Switzerland, enjoy your independence, my friend. Core it. Core it. Oh, I can't core it. Interesting. Whatever. Alright, and yeah, France has been cut in half. I love it. Good times were had by all. Uh, let's go ahead and get Normandy... in uh in force peace look at that he's close he's like well maybe let's do this shit normandy let's do it all right he did not he did not accept peace normandy why don't you want peace what is your major malfunction normandy he's like i don't want peace but why normandy why all right, you can have some generals. And what is this? What could it be? What could it be now? Make Brandenburg vote for us. We can't do that. We have a female ruler coming up. And while we're in a regency, for how long? Uh, six more years. Six more years of regency, meaning we can't declare any wars. But we can enforce peace, which we're going to do. All right, let's take... Let's just cut you in half. Oh, wait, shit. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Have a general. Go.
All right, do we need to put our foot down? I mean, there is pretty high revolt risk. We might want to put our foot down. Maybe. Maybe, baby. Ooh, Boulon has a core here. I've never heard of Boulon. La Boutique Boulangerie. Guinez. Oh, there's Guinez. Guinez is here. Hey, Guinez. Long time no see, Guinez. I know. Yeah, some of the normal cores. Yeah, we can definitely fabricate on Francy Pants. Fabricate on Rethel. I want your land, France. Well, more like I want my trade node, which includes Rethel. Yeah, we have almost we have almost all of the land on the trade node. The only thing we're missing is Vermandois, Cambrai, Rethel, Champagne, and Namur. And then if we annex our vassal Luxembourg, then him as well. But we probably won't annex Luxembourg ever. He's my little pet. He is my pride and joy. All right, we need to get over here and stop him sieging because he can, you can see there's no X. That means he can individually piece out these guys. Damn it. So uh, let's make sure the check mark is off. It is. All right, he is, rec he is recruiting dudes like nobody's business. He wants to party. He wants to party. He wants, he wants to party. He wants to party. He wants, he wants to party. Let's bring these guys up this way. Let's go sit in Picardy. You guys can sit in Burgundy. And let's see what happens here. Most likely, yeah, he's going to Picardy. That's fine. Nope, he wants to go to Champagne. No, 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 come back. Come back, dude. Oh, no, now he is going over there. Okay, interesting. Yep, my vassals are all getting out of order here. You can't really corral your vassals, though. They have a mind of their own. Can we get in there and help? If we can just get there and help, I'll be a happy man. We got the walls busted in Paris. That's nice. Swabia, follow me. There we go, 15th, okay, hold on. 16th, perfect, all right, let's do this. Yeah. Come on, good rolls, good rolls, good rolls. Come on, come on, come on. I'm not seeing good rolls here. Stop with the bad rolls, give me the good rolls. There we go. Oh my goodness, that, we lost way too many people there. He's retreating to armor. All right, follow, follow that masked man. And that's it. Okay, his army is dead. Now all we have to do is siege. Carpet siege. get everyone else out of the way now the task is just to stop him from raising new units yeah, these missions are terrible these missions are terrible oh shit we're gonna attack in Paris really okay Yeah, I know. There's rebels in Charlotte. I don't really care. So, Sinian heretics, we'll take care of them. take uh, one soldier now nah, take two soldiers and the rest of us just go go smack him in the face sup bro squeeze good times all right carpet siege go now you guys please take out the rebels 
Oh, champagne has fallen already. That was quick. Good times. Uh, you can take over that siege, because I, I don't want any regular troops sieging. Only the mercs may siege. Oh, shit. More rebels. Fuck. Get out of here. Fucking rebels, man. Tells ya. Alright. Get out of the way. And let's take our... Those guys down here. There we go. Carpet siege. Good. Mm. What are the Flander ideas? They're Dutch ideas. So, plus 10% inflation reduction. Or plus 0.1 inflation reduction. Merchants plus 1. Trade range plus 10%. Production efficiency plus 10%. Naval leader fire plus 2. Tolerance of heretics plus 3. Siege ability plus 10 and infantry combat plus 10 along with our traditions which are plus 50% naval force limits modifier and shipbuilding time and then at the very end after we do all this we get 10% more national trade income which is nice but it's going to be a long way down the road uh seed normandy to me oh i mean they, they want to seed champagne to me now you can do better than that you can do better oh right we need a blockade uh Yes, blockade. Just because otherwise it's going to take forever to get these forts down. Alright. Speed 5, go. And I guess after this we'll annex Mercia. Much as I like having a vassal up there, it does me little good if uh, I can't expand his lands at all. So, nah. Oh, we have a thousand dollar dues. Let's get some more manpower buildings. Manpower. Good times. And we used all of our money doing that. Wow. Romney will become a vassal of Rus. Romney will pay 54 ducats. All right. Really? You vassalized a one province miner? What's the point of vassalizing this guy with two base tax? I mean, wow. You got to be pretty fucking lazy to vassalize that guy. Lithuania is at war with Livonia. Yep. Okay, we got a claim on Francie Pants. Let's get another claim on Francie Pants. Let's claim Nev Never. Yeah, let's claim Never. Claim Never. Screw you, France. Actually, why am I claiming Never? That's not on my trade node. That's on the Bordeaux trade node. Ah, whatever. I'm trying to stay in theme, man. You know what, though? We're out of time for this episode today. Thank you guys for joining me. I have been Shen. You have been you. Come back next time where we will peace out uh, Normandy. I'll see you then. Have a good day. God, the Cumans are massive.